I see, you have to then re-equip a slide move. Okay, well, that's just a little bit of a waste of time for an energy tank. I honestly don't really need them. This game isn't that difficult. I'm sure it likes to think it's that think it's that difficult, but it's really not. Okay, now this is just bothering me. All right, dude, I'm gonna equip a uh, fire blast. Yeah, fire blast will kill him in one hit. All right, so I've already opened up the path. I guess I could run down there if I wanted to. There we go. Now there's no exit. I have to go back with my ninja skills. There. We got back. There's no problem. Right, let me check my recording real quick. Okay, we're still keeping good frames. That's nice. Just continuously jump here. This part's easy. Just walk straight. Then land here. Jump and then you're done. Just walk through this. It'll take less damage than you just waiting for you to kill it. This is the last screen before we go to fight Blizzard Man. What you want to do is just stand here, jump on this, stand on this, and whoa. Okay, that was a little bit scary. For some reason, I had trouble making it there. Switch to Fire Blast. Whatever it's called, I think it was Fire Blast. Could be mixing up Pokemon names, I don't know. Oh, dude, what are you doing? There we go. Just wait for him to stop doing that. Hit him with Fireball. Repeat. Hit him with the Fireball. <laughs> Hit him with the Fireball. Hit him with the Fireball. And you're done. Yeah. So, we are roughly 16 minutes into recording, and we are almost halfway done. Almost. No, we're not halfway done. We're almost halfway done, though. At least with the Robot Masters. And after that, you just fight uh, the X stage in here, and the X stages, and... Yeah. Who do we want to do next? We'll do Yamato Man. I would do Plant Man because I believe he gives you Jet Mega Man. I am, I'm not 100% sure, but I know Yamato Man the best, so... Or roughly the best. I always thought this was one of the coolest stages, and this was one of the first Robot Masters I ever beat, and... A buddy of mine, when we were talking about Mega Man, and we this is when we watched Battle Network, and uh, we said, what Net Navi would you want if you got uh, one from Mega Man? And we just basically named ones from Mega Man 6. He had one, he had Blizzard Man, and I had Yamato Man. Which I thought was kind of interesting. Right, we don't need that extra life, I guess. If you had Jet Mega Man, I guess you could get it. Watch out for these things. They'll be continuously coming throughout the stage. And of course I got hit. Yeah, don't do any jumping if you see him. Just stand there. Okay. Just keep on moving. Here's the alternate path, I guess, in here. This must be where you can do the beat thing again. Um, you could use Jet Mega Man to get up there. I don't have it, so I guess I won't be doing it. If you want to watch out here, there's going to be a fish that jumps up at the end. Trust me, I got killed by it, like, the first time I did this, and when I hadn't played it in a while, so... Yeah, something you want to watch out for. That thing is a sneaky little man. 
he will kill you. Jump up here. You can either wait, take the time to kill that dude if you want to, or you can just slide under him. I honestly don't care if I get hit. Right, and we are at Yamato Man. The only thing that's standing in our way is this spear dude. All you have to do is jump over his little things and his little spinning spear things. And there. Don't have to do anything fancy, just jumping works. Don't have to slide or anything crazy. We are at Yamato Man. What he does is he does his like flip thing and does throws spears like that. He's not too difficult, but he's a very fun little dude to fight. Ah, oh, and he got me. Oh well. Wipe our feet with him. And that was Yamato Man. Quite simple. Do you get Y Spear, which is Yamato Spear, I guess. Saving the game. Alright, now we've only got four more Robot Masters. I think we'll go with Tomahawk Man next. This is cool, the very first thing that you see is a cowboy robot. He's kinda cool, I guess. I thought that was kinda neat that they put cowboy robots in here with guns. Right, so fall down this hole. Shoot the cowboy robot master again. Slide. And of course I screwed that up. Probably could have hit that with somebody else. Just stand here and just continuously fire charge shots. I guess you have to... Wait. There we go. Got that. Alright, just keep on moving. Wait for Eddie. Again, he's not giving me energy tanks. He's been giving me those little circular life bars. Not that I really desperately need the energy tanks. I assume this must be another beat thing. Because, um... You can get up there with Jet Mega Man. And I wish that phone wouldn't ring, but whatever. Anyway. Just keep on moving. Jump down the hole. Hit that dude. Watch out for this dude. You can kill him with Power Mega Man if you want to. Come on. I plan on skipping him. There we go. Alright, so, I'm just going to use normal Mega Buster. You could have stood over here and done it. It would have been a little easier for you, but, I mean, it's all personal preference. Whoa, and I just about fell down there. Right. This may be another alternate path, I'm not sure. I assume that must be another alternate path to Tomahawk Man. 
that one up there may not have been, it may have just been to some extra lives or something. I'm not really sure. Since I don't have Jet Mega Man and I don't know this game by heart that well. Anyway, we're at Tomahawk Man. He shouldn't be too bad. Check my frames, they're doing good. Alright. All he does is this move. And then that. And that's it. And then he jumps at you, does the same thing. Sometimes he'll lunge forward at you, and that is kind of a pain. Especially when he backs you into a corner like this. But it's basically all about jumping over his little projectiles. And I'm just about to die if I don't hurry up. I don't know what he's weak to at the moment. I'm just trying to get through the level. Yeah, that's right. Wipe my feet with you. Yeah. <sighs> he is just kind of annoying. But, um... Anyway, the next thing... Silver Tomahawk. Nice. So now, what, we only have two Robot Masters left, Wind Man and Plant Man. I believe that's it. We are just breezing through this game, and 25 minutes in. 